ever trust this asshole. Hello. Guess Skizza won't be needing this. Oh. Mm. I, I can't do this anymore. It's okay, I'm fine. What's going on? I'm a goddamn veterinarian. I went to school to cure colic and heaves and hoof disease. Does this look like a fucking hoof to you? Addie, no, Addie. you saw what happened to Boozer. I can't do this. Addie, Addie. so many wounded. Addie. And so many die. Addie. Deacon, I am not a doctor. Okay, maybe not. But you're all we've got. Hey, Deke. So I want to go check on the explosives to make sure, you know, the rippers didn't steal them, and then I went to Schizo's cabin to check on the deck cords, but I should have just come straight here and saved some time. Get the hell out of here, Ricky. I guess we can go blow up that cave, right? I'll come with you. When I was a kid, my dad found a rat's nest underneath one of our sheds. You want to know what he did? Can't even guess. Well, I waited till morning. They'd all be asleep. He laid a piece of plywood over the hole and told me to go get the garden hose. And he said to me, I never forget what he said to me. He said the best way to kill a rat's nest is to drown him. You can blow up the reservoir above the camp? Oh, that's an idea. Deacon, you can't. They want to rest in De peace. I'm going to help them out. Deacon, you can't do that. Why is that? Because of Iron Mike? Because of some fucking treaty? You know, I want to cut Schizo's throat, but he's right about one thing. Carlos ain't going to stop. Rippers ain't going to stop. And you know it. Are you sure this isn't personal? Fuck yeah, it's personal. Okay. Nice rifle. Oh, yeah, a little present from Schizo. Remind me to be there when you give it back to him. You'll be there. <laughs> that goddamn schizo. So what are we gonna do with the bastard? I mean, we're not letting Iron Mike put him on trial, are we? No, we're not! Alright, so what's the plan? I know the area pretty well. Sarah, um... I worked out of a lab south of Iron Butte Ranch. I used to ride out there, pick her up for lunch. Harder to ride on some of those back roads. Jesse, Carlos, whatever the hell he's calling himself. He's taking over the old golf course and resort. Just south of the lodge is the Crescent Lake Reservoir. Now we blow that dam, that lake's gonna flood down into the valley and it's gonna drown them all, like rats. Okay, but isn't the lodge up on the hill? Yeah, yeah, flood probably won't do much to it, but it'll do enough damage to the rest of the river compound to take out most of his men. Uh, and if Jesse survives, he won't see us coming. You got it. Now we just gotta figure out how to get into the Iron Butte Valley without being seen, yeah? I'll get us there. You just hang on.
ain't gonna make this easy. Nope. Okay. Hey, what are you doing? Figured I'd take this bag of explosives down there and ask him if they didn't mind us, you know, blowing him the fuck up. Boozer. Look, you stay up here with Skizzo's rifle and keep him off me while I set the charges. Oh, hold, hold on. Look, look, I got this. I'm not much good in a firefight, but I can plant these charges. I've set demo charges before, Boozer, in Afghanistan. I know exactly where to put them. Good. Tell me where to go when I'm down there. We're doing this? Yeah. All right. I'm gonna be up in this tower. Should give me a good view of the entire dam. I'll wait here until you get up there. Stay low, move fast. You got it, brother. Who's it? Oh, never mind. Go, go. I can use this. What, where do I set the first charge? You see the second set of scaffolding on top of the dam? Okay. Keep going. Kind of busy here. You got him? Shooting, Teague. Keep it up. Yeah, thanks. He called it the penstock, the big pipe, the base of the dam. Yeah, I see it. Heading over. Ho, 
Holy shit! Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think so. Unless, wait a minute, was this already? <laughs> oh, that never gets sold, does it? Uh. Let's, uh, let's go find Jesse. Yeah. Brother, you, uh, you did a hell of a job back there. Yeah? yeah? I thought I was done for a couple of times. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. What the hell are you talking about? This is the most alive I've felt since... Uh, shit. You remember when we got trapped by that horde in Tumalo? We ain't done yet. How many do you think we killed? I don't know. They had it coming, right? Yeah, they had it coming. Guess we all did. All right, looks like we go in on foot from here. You want to stay? Keep any stray rippers from ripping off my bike? Yeah, I don't think we need to worry about that. And fuck that. This... This is on Jesse. He wanted some payback. I'll show him some fucking payback. Come on, let's head to the lodge. Like I said, right behind you. This must be what it looked like after Noah's flood. Came and washed away all the wicked. Yeah, except God had nothing to do with this one. Yeah. You get my point. Ah, oh, shit. More rippers. How the hell did they survive? That's a breaker. Yeah. <laughs> 
Come on. Come on. Find Jesse. Oh, yeah. It's time to finish what we started. Hey, these guys seem more jacked up than usual. Oh, yeah. They must have snorted up the rest of whatever the hell drug they take. There's no way you're getting up there. <laughs> That is not Carlos up there, okay? Not this founder, rest in peace. It's fucking Jesse Williamson. Fucking low-life piece of shit scumbag who got what was coming to him. All right. Now you fucking go up there and kill that son of a bitch. Chicken Sinchon. 
brought low by the lowly Jesse Wilson. I brought low. Oh, do you remember back in the day? You and Boozer held me down while Jack burned the flesh from my back. You cannot touch me. Those, those memories kept me from being free. It was good being on this shit again, you know. I gotta say, shoveling shit and you know, pulling weeds. I know maybe it isn't such a bad way to spend the day. Yeah. Well, with Jesse gone, how many you think are left? People that we knew from before, I mean. No one. Boo, so there's no one left. Shut. Sorry. Uh. Yeah. Me too. Come on, let's get the yeah, fuck out of here. Well, like I said, I... I know we haven't talked in a few years. I... Yes, I disfigured with my Elizabeth being there with you and all. There probably wasn't much point in me yammering away at you. Oh, and then... And what with all hell breaking loose, I... I thought maybe you weren't there. Or you just didn't give a shit. Pardon my language. I guess that's why I'm here. See, I still don't know. I hope you're there. I hope there's some reason for all this shit we're living through. That's all. Well, we'll, we'll talk again some other time. Oh, um, amen. Deke? Uh, <clears throat> yeah, Ricky told me that I could find you here. Oh! Uh, ah, it's just these knees of mine, you know. It's reason I haven't been praying all these years. Yeah, I'm not a... I'm not a church-going type. Even after living through that shit storm in Sherman's camp. But now... After all this, I just thought, hell, I... Maybe now it's the time. I, uh... I didn't have a choice, Mike. Oh, everybody's got a choice, Deke. Until they're dead. It's either us or them. <laughs> it's always us or them. Always. You know the reason we're going to hell? is we can't figure out that us is every goddamn soul that ain't walking around in shit-stained pants trying to eat us! All right, you know what? You may not like it, but the world is what it is. Yeah, it is. Praying ain't gonna change that. Wishing that it was something else ain't gonna make it that way, Mike.
Wish it ain't got anything to do with it. We make the world what it is by what we do. All of us. I let him go. Schizo. Ain't no way he was getting a fair trial. You let him go. Told him to ride out, not come back. <sighs> Jesus Christ, Mike, do you have any idea what the fuck you've done? Yeah. I stopped another killing. And you know what? I guess I'm good with that.